So please welcome Zach Wow yeah. of Black Label Society. Yeah. There he is. Come on in. Dude, my favorite you. part about hanging out with Mr. Zach Wild is he my smells brother. so good. Yes. You are right. He, he smells, smells good. so good. Dude, and he, this is something, it's, 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 it's like a it. thing. It's always, he's smelling good. Way better than A new me. cologne black label septic tank. Oh. <laughs> Coming out soon. I love that. Do we love what's that going on? Are you guys, you. Do you guys go to school around here as well? Yeah. <laughs> no, but you, know. you and I, 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 you guys know that my... Zach's high school is the same one my daughter Jessica went to, believe it or not. Ah. Jackson, she survived. New Jersey and Jackson survived Memorial it. High School. That's right. It's amazing. I was a I class even... of 2018. Yeah. Of course it was. And yeah. Nobody's even questioning <laughs> yeah. anything. You know, my, be my beard would be older than 2018. Yeah. 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 You know, it's true. But it's great to see my Jersey brother. How you been, man? How's everything? I'm doing going good, buddy. Him? We're getting, uh, I guess we're just home for a little bit. So, we, you know, we're out with the anthrax fellas and. and Father Jamie Jossa. Yeah. The Robert Redford, Tony Robbins, Anthony Robbins of metal. That's yes. such yes. a yeah. great tool. A handsome fella and an also an amazing motivational speaker yes. as well. You just Absolutely. read the lyrics. <laughs> it's all about, it. yeah, when you get knocked down, you got to get back up. Yeah. You know, you never quit. That's what we but, love. Uh, yeah, that's, that's why you got to love Father Jossa. But uh, no, we had a blast with the gang and then... Uh, and I guess right now we're going to be rolling out right now. Getting, after after this, we uh, roll down to South America. Yeah. So we're rolling with the Brazilian chapter. Are you right. ready for Dude, that? shit gets nuts down in South America. I've been some, to some shows down there, and the metal kids fucking bring it. Yeah, they, they, I've heard. And yes, it they lose are, their they minds. They definitely are. Uh, it's intense. Th they're all in, for sure. Yeah. Without a doubt. Yeah. So, and and it's know. always impressive, too, because you guys are obviously singing in English, and that is not their language, but they sure as fuck know every word. And they almost sing it louder than you guys, I feel well, like. Well, no, I mean, well, you just had, it is pretty crazy like that. They're with, loud. I'm saying the, the, the universal appeal of music, like like yeah. Rammstein just did two nights at the uh, the Coliseum in L.A. Which is yeah. unbelievable. No, yeah. all the lyrics were in German. Yeah, yeah. yeah but we like so it. No one knows any lyrics, and there's 200,000, 100,000 people it's each crazy. night it's yeah. so to cool. go to the show. That's it. And it was the same way when they played Jersey. They went out there and did our old. Yeah, uh, like, what did they play, Giant Stadium yeah. or something? You know, yeah. so I yeah. mean, it's just like, uh, y yeah. And, and, uh, and yeah. no, nobody knows any of the lyrics. But it's amazing, and you know it's cool because down, down there in Latin America, it's the same. It's the same thing. They love the rock. Yep. You know what I mean? No, no. What I, I'm, I'm just saying, like that's the universal appeal. There of it is. The, the music, universal you know? language. Yeah, the language. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah. 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 Which, is, which is awesome. You know what I mean? Totally. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it's funny. Speaking of Anthrax, I was down there, 2019, when they played Rock and Rio for the first time, and I was shocked. I was like talking to Charlie. Talking to Scotty and the guys, I'm like, so guys, man. Yeah, I know you're I saying go, in 40 years. I go, how many times? Time. I go, how many times have you played there? They're like, this is it, our first time. I was like, holy shit. Well, I remember that was, it was even with Oz, we, uh, when we played, I think, Australia with Ozzy, it was like the first time since, it was when uh, Mike Inez and Randy Castillo, like, we all got, got the No More Tears band back together. Yeah. To go down to Australia because mom was like, this is the first time Ozzy's played Australia since Sabbath played there in like 73 or something. You know, yeah. oh, wow. I was like, wow, Ozzy hasn't been down to Australia in, in like ever. Yeah. You know, so, but then it always blew me away too. I mean, like, you know, talking about how bands that like they never play it, like Van Halen very rarely toured Europe. Yeah. Mm, you know, like during yeah. the Dave years or whatever. They went over there with Sabbath Yeah. in 78, but I mean, like, it wasn't like. You know, usually after every record, you tour the world. Yes, right. Exactly. You get everywhere. Yeah, and only I, after the first album. Right. That was yeah. it. Yeah. And they would never were back. You know, which is kind of weird. You yeah. Know what I mean, so I would just because even with Black Label, I'm just like, you know, we you tour the world. Yeah. Always. You know I mean? Absolutely. So, but anyways, but uh, yeah. So you know, just we're here tonight, and then after that, South America, right after the Brazil chapter. Yeah. Aftershock, these DWP festivals are so much fun. We're on day four right now, and we're getting there, and it's like today is another jam-packed day. You're going to need two you months to playing. recover after that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. after, that, after the four <laughs> days. So it is. It's like, oh, we need a little bit of rest. But we're going for it. I crowd surfed last night. Yeah, went did. nuts and went crazy. Well, you're intact. You know, yeah, I'm so, I'm so one person. Like My jeans, that's another story. They had holes in them, and those holes are now bigger. But, yeah. um, you know, we've had a lot of fun, and they've set everything up here. We've got our VIP guys right behind us. 
Everybody say what's up to Mr. Zach Uh, We're live on on our Twitch channel. I mean, it's so much fun. And I have to say, I need Matt Pinfield. This is the most serious conversation I've ever had with you. I expected to talk about sniffing glue and knitting sweaters. So can (laughs) Yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, well, this is the Black Label Quilt Craft Festival. Festival. (laughs) Demolition (laughs) Fest Miracle. Yes. Yes. uh, Always at all times. Yes. How are all the guys doing, though? I missed, like, the whole... The crew, how was the tour? Well, the crew's um, doing great. Out. The fellows in the band, I don't like any of them. And, uh, uh, I really oh, don't but care. I love and Jeff Fab like so me. much. Yeah, Jeff is one of my and, favorite you know, humans. Yes, exactly. I, you know, So like, whenever we order pizza, yeah. I just uh, make sure I get the margarita for them. I make sure it's rat arsenic and glass. <laughs> yeah. You know, yeah. I ask for that special. Yeah, my but, favorite. You know. But well, you know, so but aside of that, no, everybody's doing great. Good. So. It's nice yeah. to have everybody back out doing their doing their thing. Um, I was really excited to see you playing in the middle of a massive football arena with Ozzy. That was pretty dope. Uh, yeah, that was pretty cool. I mean, rolling with the boss, and then we got uh, yeah, the SoFi Stadium thing. Yeah, so it was yeah, my it was first sick. time seeing that stadium. It's just like it's insane. Absolutely it's ginormous. Fantastic. So I yeah. mean, it's just yeah, I mean, it was just like insane. So, but no, that was a lot of fun, and then um. Actually, we just was, I was just over the house the other night because it was mom's birthday. It was her 70th birthday. I saw that. Yeah. When, when so they ha- danced together, I saw that video yeah. on Sharon's Instagram. They're Aww. dancing. That's all it's so cool. I so, had, you know, like, they're up there heart. doing the dancing and everything like that. So we're hopefully, you know, Oz gets, you know, they glue them back together. And we can incorporate <laughs> yeah. some of those dance steps <laughs> when we get back out on the road he- again. But, uh. Yeah, so Oz, you know, I mean, with the success of the new record and everything like that, he's all excited it's about It's incredible. That. It's so good. You know, and, and uh, I mean, nothing feels right, man. You rip on that. It's such a great track. I love that. You know, and I want to talk to you about that. Appreciate the it, brother. That's actually not me paying. I played, I gave somebody some money to play on it. I took credit <laughs> for it. But, you know, I do that a lot with Barbara Ann as well. You yeah. Know? No, I just blindfold her and pay guys to take care of business. She's like, wow, you were really incredible last night. And I'm like, thank you very much. Oh I love it. You were yeah, the best, Zach. Zach, I love It's that amazing so what thank payola you, can achieve. Yes. It's amazing. That's why you save up your paper route money for oh, things yeah. like that. There it is. Cool, Matt. Bringing yeah. it up. The well, Pantera know. reunion. Yeah. People yeah. are excited the fellas, about that. I guess that's going to be, I guess, rehearsals. I guess we're going to... Pantera boot camp starts, I think, like on the ninth or something boot like that. Yeah. Yeah. Totally, I guess, on the ninth of next month. Get back together. Yeah, so uh, we're gonna knock that out, and then um, I guess the first shows are like in December or something like that. Yeah, and That's you know, because Sharon crazy, was man. saying to me, Sharon was talking about that, like Ozzy was feeling right, he was gonna get excited, maybe do stuff right in the new year, but definitely festivals next summer, right? Well, that's what they're talking about. So I mean, you know, Oz just has to keep doing his therapy and all that stuff. So I yeah. mean, hopefully. You know, and I just told them, I said, Oz, everyone will be there when you're, <laughs> when ready. you're ready. Yeah, yeah. we're yeah. not yeah. going so, like, anywhere. Don't, don't, exactly. yeah. I, I get set in a deadline, you know what I mean? But yeah. like for opening day, you know, to, for him to pitch. But if he can't pitch... Yeah. Well, we can wait until after the All Star break. You know, I, yeah, I'm just I mean, it's no one of those things. Run. I know yeah. you have to get ahead on it to, like, I guess, be the agent that books the the venues. No, no, and stuff I, like I that. completely they get They have to all get the... ahead on that, but at the same time, they could literally announce something, and be like, "Hey, Ozzy's doing this next week, and it's gonna be fucking sold oh out. My God, it's fucking Ozzy. Awesome. Yeah, you I'm, know, I'm saying, I mean, I, we're all gonna be there. If if it happens in 2023 or 2024 or 2025. We're all there. We'll all be there. It, yeah. And it'll yeah. be like, I mean, like after COVID, you know, I mean, I'm just saying Ugh. the two years that went by on that. I, I remember a- I remember the f- the last show we did was at the the rave at, in, with the Milwaukee chapter. That was the last show we did. And then, like, when we came back, I think, like, the second or third show when we had come back from COVID, we were on the same stage. Oh, and I wow. was like, I was like. Matt, you know, this was two years ago. We were stand two years. Yeah. yeah. Like, just went by in the blink of an eye. And I, I was just like... That weird feeling. Yeah, I don't right? remember high school going by that fast. But, yeah. I mean, you know, right. that was like four years of, I couldn't like, even get seven molasses thousand. going uphill in January. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. But, uh, yeah. but, no, it was just... So, uh, you know, if, if it happens in... 2024, 20, 20, I'm just saying, whenever Ozzy's ready to go, he's ready to go. The most important thing is that he is ready to go. I mean, and, and that he feels comfortable with it and that the doctors feel comfortable and everything like that. We want to see him. I was at the 2018 New Year's Eve show, which was his yeah, last show, but I was there. The, yeah, totally. I got to be there. That was the last gig we did. Yeah, mm. and and I got to be there for serious. I got to interview Ozzy, and that was like a, like a check mark. Oh, like, wow, oh, my God, yeah. I've interviewed Ozzy Osbourne. Yeah, totally. It was so cool. He's, <laughs> and he was just telling me how cool. I, I told him how cool his jewelry was. He's like, oh, I stole it from Sharon. <laughs> yeah, like, of course you did. Exactly. <laughs> I'm glad you went over for the birthday. Have you seen yeah. that uh, 
the documentary on Sharon yet, the Helen Back, the one that... I haven't seen there. it yet, no. So I'm in that but throughout it, but I haven't seen it yet either, and I want to see it. My uh, friends say it's great. Okay, cool. It's amazing. i, I got to check it out. But it's a to-do list. Yeah, so i got to check that out. But it's totally, you know, I mean, she's the best, and uh, I love them. I'm fucking psyched you're going back. Tell me about when you go to South America, how many gigs do you usually do, like when you do that run? What's that? Was like it? when you hit South America, like Brazil. What, I, I think mean, we're we're going to be there from the 12th to the 23rd or something like that. But that's just Brazil only. We're not doing all of South America on this run. Wow. It's so just Sao Brazil. Paulo, Rio. What are the, what yeah, are we're doing all of them. So, I mean, it's actually from the 12th to the 23rd. We're, we're going to be there for that. All, all of Brazil. Wow. I mean, usually we do all of South America. We do Mexico, Mexico City. and You know what I mean? Yeah. So, yeah. On this run, we're just doing Brazil. Yeah. So uh, maybe we'll be going back again, you know, South America. So, uh, well, I mean, I know we're going to be back down there with, you know, Pantera. Yeah. Yeah. So that's in December. But, I mean, you know, with Black Label, who knows? So, you know, maybe when we go back down there. So yeah. I, I know then we're talking about going back out with uh, Anthrax and the Robert Redford of metal. Uh, yeah. Father take, Jamie Johnson. That. Dude, I, that is such a great tour. Like, I love you, it. you three out together, and then, of course, Anthrax celebrating 40 years and everything. I mean, it just, it, it was a complete package. No, and I'm happy I mean, it's, it went it's well. crazy because I've known Scott and, you know, Charlie and Frankie and, and the guys ever since when I started with Ozzy. Yeah. You yeah. know, like when we were playing in Pensacola, Florida, the first arena we did, it would, and the guys were there. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's just like I've known them since my first gigs with Ozzy. In 88. Yeah. You know what I mean? Full so, circle. Yeah, so it's great that Family. we're actually finally doing something together. Yeah. Fin- after all this time, you know? Yeah, and, and that friendship has lasted with those guys all this time. Yeah, without it's a doubt. But we were just saying how, I mean, how many of our friends that either don't, or that were amazing musicians that don't play music anymore, or what, I'm just saying, where life leads you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or, you know, so, and because, you know, Scott was even talking about like with Anthrax, you know, like he goes back, you know, from us playing Lemoors, doing that playing clubs, and then oh my God, we're playing arenas with Ozzy, and then eventually, you know, Anthrax having their run, and then he goes and Zach, and then it was like there was lean years again, you know, where it was like we were playing smaller places again, and now it's there's a, it's an it's on the upswing again, yeah. you know. So but like, you know, a lot of people quit. Yeah. You know, I mean, you gotta, you know, something has to be said for hanging in there and plowing through it. Absolutely. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, because I know, uh, you know, a lot of my friends have either just said, nah, I couldn't take it anymore, or you're not, they don't like being on the road anymore. You know right. what I mean? Yeah. So, uh, Were I, get, you I get that too. I mean, I still love it. So, I mean, it's just, yeah. I, I, I've i never said I, I can't wait to go home. I, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I, I love, love going out and playing. Yeah, yeah, I love, yeah, I love playing and then I, I and I love my time at home. Yeah, you know my family, but I mean it's just like, but I also love. You know, that's the reason why you have pictures of Jimmy Page up on the wall and and all your guys. So I mean it's Those just your uh, heroes, and you're like they. Yeah, you're doing. Or? You're playing professional football now, and then now I want to go home. Right. Yeah, you know. So to yeah. me, it's just like I I'm doing what I love. So, you know, it it. it but I, I know a lot of other guys though, just like now nah, I couldn't take it anymore. I exactly I didn't like being away from home. Right. So, and which I understand, I get, I get both sides of the, I understand both sides of the coin. Yeah. Though. But I love that you're still going and you're still crushing. Yeah. The it. chat's and definitely like happy. They still fun. want to be out. I know JD's show. not, yeah. he's not very appreciative that I'm still out here doing it because he has to hear my playing every night. So. <laughs> 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 he's, he's not enjoying it either. I didn't talk about that. I remember, you know, like it's quite annoying. But I remember I'm sitting there with our, uh, with our second son Hendrix. We were sitting in the kitchen. I think Barb was on the phone or doing dishes or something and I, I you know just cleaning up the kitchen and I was like behind her and I'm just like you know lovingly groping her you know and then the whole thing is she's just like Zach stop I'm trying to get something done right you, you're annoying me right and I go <laughs> so I kept doing it she goes honestly you're really annoying me now and then Hendrix goes but mom that's what he does he <laughs> annoys <laughs> I, and I always tell Barb, I go, you should. I go, you messed up. You, you should have read the fine print. Dude, it's the in fine the contract. Print. I, it's in the contract. Yeah, I yeah. sometimes yeah, it's say it's in there. there. It's the fine. It says he annoys. It's yeah. the fine it's, print. So I bet, like, by the time that the the whole COVID situation was wrapping up, she was like at the door, being like, "Go, get on tour." Oh man. wow, yeah. Well, you know, it's because every morning we wake up, I look right in her eyes, and she she looks yeah. at me, and I look at her, and there's silence, and then I just go. <laughs> You're the lucky winner! <laughs> oh my god! 
I give her that every day. So, you know, we just, are just the a lucky little ones reminder. today here at Aftershock because you are taking stage with the Boys Black Label Society here at Aftershock. Day four, uh, lots of bands playing. We got Muse headlining. Are you checking out any bands today in your busy schedule? If we can, we, we without a doubt. You know, yeah. we'll check them out. But I mean, I think uh, and then we got we're, we're flying. Uh, like you said, we're going to be flying yeah. to South America and stuff I mean, like it's that. Busy. So. It's work, man. Yeah. Yeah. But I mean, that's all the cool thing about the festivals is catching up with people. Yeah. And seeing friends them and, yeah, and then and seeing all the cool bands. You, you know, know so. uh, Jake from Them Evils is here. So look out for oh, him. Very He's cool. been you gotta, gotta love them evil. Yep, yeah, you've taken them out before. Uh, we, yep, I agree with Zach Sabbath. Totally. Yeah. Building their empire from yeah. the band. Yeah. yeah. Yep. So. That's what I always tell kids, man. I go, that they're all in. Yeah. yeah. You gotta be all in. Yeah. yeah you have to. Because you, you gotta go, this living. is what I want to do with my life, and yeah. then that's it. Yeah. And just get the band, the U Haul. And now you're definitely committed. Oh, yeah, exactly. God. Yeah, there's no, there's no turning the back band. at that point. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What you, what you, like I told Barb, now you're fully in. So, you know. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Uh, Zach, yeah, thank you so coming, much man. for hanging out. Well, always the great talking uh, to you guys. And then, uh, and that's about it. So let me go get my, I got to put my rouge and my eyeliner to max my fishnets and my stilettos. Nice. So I have to go yes. do that now. Nice. Yes. So do it any other like way. I said, you got to be all in, man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you be all in. That's it. Zach, uh, take care, man. And listen, I know you got a little bit of time at home to get ready to go, but have a great tour down there. When I appreciate go. it, my brother. All right, gang. And, great and talking with, to you. with Pantera and everything. Thank you. Yeah, awesome. uh, we love you. Yeah. Zach Wild, ladies and gentlemen. Wild. Let's hear it. Zach. My brother. Aww, we love Good him. times. Zach, my brother. So good to see you. I got another side of that, man. Absolutely.